Hello friends, it is Little Miss Coupons and it is CVS. So that means CVS Sunday and as you guys know, this is always one of my favorite days of the week. I absolutely love couponing at CVS. I know it hasn't been super amazing lately, but there still are some really, really good stuff going on. So I'm excited to be here. I'm excited to show you guys what we got going on in that new account that I brought you guys along with me to create was probably about five weeks ago, I would say. I'm gonna go back and check to see. Finally got loaded with some fire CRTs. So again, if you guys are keep getting the same CRTs every week and you're like, what the heck? And it's driving you nuts. <laughs> it's time to make a new account. So now I have two newer accounts. One is probably three to four months old. And then the other one is just like five weeks old. And those accounts are getting really awesome CRTs totally worth it to start a new one if you know somebody who would let you use their phone number or like even if you bought like or if you had an old phone laying around you bought like a $30 phone card from Walmart just to get a new number to use like I'm sure you could do something like that just saying I know that that's like going way over the top to get like another account but sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do um anyways I know you guys are probably looking at me like, oh, she looks kind of like crap today. Um, my whole house has pink eye. Don't worry though, I am not contagious anymore. Um, but my eyeballs are killing me, so that's why this one looks like really bad. See that, you guys? Um, totally no fun. Um, but again, I've been doing what I need to do for long enough now that I'm not contagious, so we are good to go into CVS and grab some deals. This is a little bit longer of an intro than I normally do lately. <laughs> um, but yeah, so if you're not subscribed, please subscribe. It's totally free. Smash the like button for me. It really, really helps me out. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know if you're new, where you're from, if you plan on going to CVS this week, what you plan on getting, and all of that fun stuff. Um, make sure your notification bell is turned on so you're notified when I post a video. And thank you, thank you, thank you so much for watching and supporting my channel so far. So let's get into CVS and grab some of these deals. All right, friends, you guys always know I start off by buying a caramel on each one of my accounts. And guess what I got? Deadly Squat. Not a single threshold coupon today at all. And I was like, oh my God, wait, I think that I have my 10 off 70s from last week that I didn't use yet. And I was thinking they were expired and I would have to have the paper coupon to use them one day past. And then I realized they're all just setting right here. So we're good to go. I have at least four of those. So let's just get rocking and rolling. All right, friends, so the first deal I am gonna start off with, I believe, is the Colgate Total. I'm gonna grab two of them for $6.29. So that's gonna be $12.58. We have a $5 off two digital, and then I have a two off of eight CRT on this account. This is one of my newer accounts. Um, on this account, I have no 10 off of 70, so I'm not doing one of those transactions yet. Um, but that would bring me down to $5.58, getting $5 back in extra bucks, but I only need a $2.99 more to get me um, up to my fetch rebate where I get $1.20 back, 1,200 points. So this should get me up there and it would make them a 62 cent money maker. I'm gonna show you a couple other ways you could do this deal. Um, you could also do sensitive, which is the way I was going to do this because I feel like we never can get the Colgate sensitive for cheap. Um, so if you wanted to grab these, which I'm probably going to do on another account, you would do two of them. Mine are $7.29, so it would be $14.58. I have the $5 off two digital and then the two off of eight CRT would bring me down to $7.58. Getting $5 back in extra bucks would make them a cost of $2.38 for the pair or $1.29 each but I should get that dollar twenty back, so it would make them a cost of like a dollar thirty something, which is a really good deal for the Colgate sensitive toothpaste. So the other way you can do this deal, the cheapest way, which is the way that I actually think I'm going to go for on the rest of my accounts, is to grab two of these at four dollars and sixty nine cents. So that would be two or nine dollars and thirty eight cents for the pair. Use the five dollar off two digital, and then my two off eight CRT that'll take seven dollars off. We'll be down to two dollars and thirty eight cents, getting four dollars back in extra bucks plus my dollar twenty back from fetch. 
that would make these two a two dollar and 82 cent money maker so i'm actually gonna go with these ones on most of my accounts and then for one of my accounts i'll pick up the sensitive so I absolutely love when I'm able to get like stuff that I've never been able to get before. Um, and on this account, I have some really awesome CRTs. And what I think I'm going to do, because the when you spend $30 on any L'Oreal Age Perfect or Revitalift, you get $10 extra bucks. I'm gonna pick up one of these for $29.49. I think I might do this one. Um, I have a $4 off CRT that's gonna come off. I have an eight off of 30. And this is gonna work because 98% of 30 is 29.40, so we are nine cents over. And then I have that $2 digital coupon. All three of those should come off. We should be left to pay $15.49 and get $10 back in extra bucks. It's gonna make one of these costs just $5.49 compared to $29.49, that is absolutely amazing. Okay, friends, so next deal that I'm going to do is I'm going to pick up two of these Cetaphil moisturizing lotions. They're $10.49 each. There's exactly two left, which is super awesome. Cetaphil is on a deal. Spend $20, get $5 in extra bucks. These are going to total me up to $20.98. So what I'm going to do is use two of these $4 um, coupons from the Instagram Fairy. That's going to take $8 off. We'll be down to $12.98 at the register, getting $5 back. But then we are also going to submit to Ibotta for $2 back on each one. So we'll get an additional $4 back there. It'll make the pair a cost of $3.98 or $1.99 each, which is absolutely amazing. All right, the next deal I want to do is on the Irish Spring and the Soft Soap. They are buy one, get one 40% off, buy two, get a $4 extra buck. I'm going to pick up one of these Irish Springs for $6.79. We have a $2 digital coupon for this. And then I'm going to pick up one of these for 40% off, which will be $3.96. Um, and we have a $2 digital for this. So the pair is going to come up to $10.75. We are going to get $4 off in digitals. That'll bring us down to $6.75, getting $4 back in extra bucks it's gonna make the pair cost just two dollars and 75 cents all right friends so covergirl cosmetics this week are spend 18 and get a six dollar extra buck there is this little sign off um that says some stuff here is like 40 percent off so i just wanted to point that out to you guys normally when stuff's on clearance at cvs so it does not count towards extra bucks i am gonna ask but i highly doubt it does so to play it safe what i'm gonna do is i am gonna pick up one or two of these for six dollars and 29 cents and one of these for 5.49 that's gonna bring me up to 18 dollars and seven cents we have a five dollar digital that should attach to one of these and then i'm gonna use two of these three dollar paper coupons that's gonna bring us down to pay seven dollars and seven cents getting a six dollar extra extra buck back it's gonna make our cost um a dollar oh seven for all three all right so next deal i'm gonna do is on some maybelline cosmetics because i have two separate 20 percent off crts for maybelline plus we have a digital coupon and an instant crt so this should work out to be a little bit of a money maker um they are spend 15 get a five dollar extra buck so I'm gonna start off by picking up one of these Maybelline New York Fit Me blushes. They are $7.99 and I have a $2 paper coupon that is gonna attach to this. I think I'm gonna get this really pink one, red one, whatever it is. Um, so we're gonna start off with that. And then I'm going to pick up one of these um, lipsticks for seven dollars and 79 cents so the two of them are going to come up to fifteen dollars and 78 cents um i'm going to use that two dollar paper coupon for the face and then we have a three dollar digital coupon that should come off for the lipstick then I have a $3 instant CRT off of Maybelline that will also come off. That'll bring us down to $7.78. But then I have two different 20% off CRTs. Because I have those, I'm not going to use extra bucks to pay. I'm going to do this separately. So the first 20% off will take off $1.55, bringing us down to $6.23. And then the second 20% off will take off $1.24, bringing us down to pay $4.99, getting a $5 extra buck back. They are free and a one cent money maker.
And oh my gosh, you guys, I'm super excited about this deal. I thought this was the only one they had for $10. I was so sad, but then I realized up here they have a bunch. So these curling irons are on sale for $10, right? So I'm going to pick up one of these. You also get $5 in extra bucks when you just buy one. So it already makes it a cost of just $5, but it gets way better than that. So I have a two off of 10 hairstyling CRT that I'm going to use. That'll bring it down to $8. And then I have a 25% off CRT that will come off. And again, I'm going to do this separately because I'm not going to use any extra bucks. That'll take another $2 off. We're going to pay $6, get $5 in extra bucks back for this. It's going to cost just $1 for this curling iron. All right, friends. So then I'm going to pick up one of these good line razors for $8.79. I am not going to do the spend 20, get seven only because this works out to be way less of a cost the way that I'm going to do it. So I have a $4 off any good line CRT that should come off. And I also have a $4 off $8 good line CRT that will also come off. It's going to make this just 79 cents. You really can't go wrong with that. Okay, so then we also have this deal. It's spend 25 on any blade, CVS Beauty, or one plus other shaving products, get $10 in extra bucks. So what I am gonna do is actually pick up two of these for $8.59, and then I'm going to pick up one of these for $7.99. That's gonna bring me up to $25.17, so we can get our $10 back in extra bucks. Now, I have two separate 40% off CRTs for these. So, since we're at $25.17, our first 40% off will come off and that's gonna take off 40% of the $25.17, which is $10.06. That'll bring us down to $15.11. And then our second 40% off is gonna take off 40% of the $15.11. I know some people have issues doing this and I did for the longest, so I wanna explain it as thorough as possible. So you take 1511 times 40% and it's gonna take $6.04 off. That's gonna bring our cost down to $9.07, getting a $10 extra buck back. This is gonna be a 93 cent money maker. You do not wanna pay with extra bucks because it'll make your percentage off CRTs go down. It won't take as much off. You'll end up paying a lot more and it wouldn't be a money maker. All right, friends, so this is everything I'm doing on my first card. I did not do a complete rundown on like what the price is gonna end up being and all of that. So I'm not using a 10 off of 70, so it is absolutely not gonna be free. Um, but I do have a lot of extra bucks on this account that I want to use and can use. I'll grab those glow sticks because they're 75% off. They end up being like $1.79. My kids love those. So I'm gonna go up, cash out. We'll just go over everything when I get back to the house. on my newest account again i don't have a 10 off of 70 but i want to do a couple deals on here to keep the crts rolling so everybody got that instant crt for like aussie or blessings whatever it's two dollars off pantene head and shoulders all that i'm going for the aussie this week they are 4.99 buy one get one 40 buy two get a four dollar extra buck so the first one's gonna be 4.99 and the second one is going to be three dollars so that's gonna be $7.99. We have that $2 instant CRT that's gonna come off, but I also have a two off of six any hair care that I am gonna use. And that is gonna bring me down to four or $3.99, getting a $4 extra buck back. These are gonna be free in a one cent money maker. Next thing I'm gonna throw in on this account is one of these Schick Intuition Razors. They are on sale for $9.99, plus you get a $5 extra buck back when you buy one this week. It would be like getting it for $4.99, except for I have a CRT for $3 off a Schick Intuition Razor on this account. So it's gonna bring my cost down for this to just $8.99. These are regular price, $15.79, so that is awesome. Next deal I'm gonna do on this account is I'm gonna pick up another um, 
um, Con Air hair product because I did have two blow dryers um, from the Revlon deal from Rite Aid, but I ended up selling one of those and I needed two for Christmas. So I'm gonna pick this one up. It's on sale for 20, but you get a $10 extra buck for buying it. So that already brings the cost down to $10, but I have another one of those 25% off hair accessory CRTs on the CVS account. So that's gonna take $5 off. So we'll pay 15 and get a $10 extra buck back. It's gonna be just $5 for this blow dryer. So on this account, I have two different CRTs for L'Oreal. Um, and L'Oreal this week is spend 15 and get a $5 extra buck. What I'm gonna do is pick up one of these telescopic mascaras because I am all out and I love this mascara. Um, it's $14.99. I have a $3 CRT and a $4 CRT that'll take $7 off. We'll be left to pay $7.99, get a $5 extra book back. The cost is gonna be $2.99. I did just wanna state today is definitely not gonna be a free haul at all but I am trying to grab some things I need and other things at very, very low cost. And that's just how today's gonna be. So I will definitely have a cost today. Okay, so last week I tried to do an Aveeno deal and I totally jacked it up. Um, so I'm not sure if I'm gonna do this deal, but I'm gonna show you guys anyways, because it's really good. Um, so the Aveeno facial products is buy two, get $6 in extra bucks. So what I would do is pick up one of these for $11.29 and one of these for $9.29. On this account, I only have one of those $2 digital coupons off of like an Aveeno facial product, but I also have a $3 CRT off of an Aveeno facial product. And then, because that just gets us to about $20, we have to be at $40 to get a $10 gift card for the Activate Rewards. I would pick up two of the Aveeno body washes at $10.29 because these are buy two, get a $10 extra buck, and that gets you the other $20 that you would need. So the four of those products would total us up to $41.16. I would use two of these coupons for the body wash that would take four dollars off so we would be at 36 no we would be at 37 16 and then we would have the other five dollars coming off for the face products which would bring us down to 32 16 then we would get sixteen dollars back in extra bucks ten for the body wash six for the face and we would get a $10 Visa card from Activate Rewards. It would make our cost for all four products $6.16, which is very, very good considering the body wash in each of those products is like $10 and over. So I wasn't gonna do this deal, but I actually think I'm going to. All right, friends, I don't know if I'm just missing it, but I cannot find this one on the list for Activate Rewards. So I'm just going to pick up this one because I know it's included. I've already checked. Um, it's just a few cents higher. So I will pay, what? what is that, 30, 29 to 99, like 70 cents more, which is not a big deal. I want to show you guys another deal that I don't think I'm going to pick up. These Cetaphil Gentle Cleansers are $11.79. If you were to pick up two of them, it would be $23.58. I would use two of these $4 coupons from the Instagram Fairy. She's linked in my description box. That would take $8 off. Plus, I have a three off of 12 Cetaphil CRT. So that would be taking $11 off total. So we would be down to $12.58. Then you could submit to Ibotta for a dollar back on each one. One that would bring you down to $10.58 and get $5 back in extra bucks. That would make two of them $5.58 or like $2.75 each, which is a really good price compared to $11.79 a piece. So this will be everything that I'm going to pick up on my newest account this week. Um, probably going to do the Aveeno deal separately so I just don't get it confused with any of the other stuff. The only thing I added in that I didn't show you is the Colgate, but you guys already know that deal. This should work out really nicely. Again, it'll have a cost, but that's okay. Um, so I'm going to move on to my next transaction, which I'm going to make a 10 off of 70 since I have them from last week. So here we go. All right, I'm starting on a 10 off 70 transaction. This may be all I have time for today is this last transaction but i'm going to add in the colgate um two of them to be nine dollars and 38 cents we have that five dollar off to digital um if you have those one dollar parables you could use those and it would glitch but i don't have any um so it'll bring me down to 538 getting four or 438 getting four dollars back it'll make them 38 cents 
I'm gonna add in the CoverGirl deal, 1807, and then I have five, excuse me, eleven dollars coming off, pay seven oh seven and get six back. Side note, the JR Watkins hand soap is five seventy nine, and when you buy one, you get two dollars in extra bucks. Um, if you have like a percentage, yeah, percentage off CRT, it would make it cheaper. But that would be like a good item if you needed something extra to throw in to get you up to like the seventy or eighty dollar mark. I'm thinking about throwing in two of the Axe body washes. I just haven't picked Axe up in a really long time. At my store, they're $6.49, so two of them would be $12.98. They're buy two, get a $2 extra buck. We have a $6.50 Axe digital coupon, and it would glitch with a $1 printable. So that would take $7.50 off. You would pay $5.48, getting a $2 extra buck back. It would make two of them $3.48, which is a pretty good deal. I am gonna throw in the soft soap and Irish spring deal. Um, you pay $6.75 and get $4 back in extra bucks, so that's a pretty good deal. I'm gonna throw in the Dove hair deal. They are two for nine dollars this week. Buy two, get a five dollar extra buck. So I'm gonna grab a shampoo and conditioner. So they're two for nine. I'm gonna use a dollar fifty printable that I have from the coupon Instagram coupon fairy for each one. They are right here. Um, that's to take three dollars off. So then we're gonna pay six dollars, get five dollars back in extra bucks. The cost is gonna be a dollar for both or fifty cents each. Then I'm going to pick up one of these Venus Smooth Razors. They're on sale for $7.99. We do have a $3 digital. That's going to bring it down to $4.99. And then we're going to get a $3 extra buck back. It's going to make it just $1.99. All right, so I wanted to throw in a Cottonelle deal, at least in one of my transactions. I think what I'm going to do is pick up three of these wipes at $4.99. Cottonelle, spend $20, get a $5 extra buck. And I'm going to pick up one of these at $5.79. That would make my total $20.70. 76 cents last i heard these two dollar coupons off the cottonelle website were scanning for all of those products so hopefully they do scan we would get eight dollars off we would pay 12.76 at the register get five dollars back in extra bucks it would make all for a cost of 776 um if not then we could use the one dollar coupons and that would only take four dollars off we would be at 16.76 getting five dollars back um it would make all four a cost of 11.76 so i'm gonna try this see if it works cross our fingers and let's go do it Okay, so here is my first 10 off of 70 transaction that I'm going to do. Everything here comes up to $75.95. After all of our coupons and stuff, we should be down to pay $31.95 pre-tax. Getting back $27 in extra bucks. Nothing on Ibotta, but that makes the cost just $4.95 for everything. All right, it's, I decided I'm going to whip together one more 10 off of 70. I'm going to start with the Lysol wipes. They're buy one, get one 50. So they're $5.79. The second one can't remember how much it is but it comes to eight dollars and 68 cents i have two digital coupons one one dollar off two and one one dollar off one they're gonna glitch and both come off so they'll bring us down to 658 we'll get two dollars back in extra bucks they'll bring us down to 458 and i have two dollars back on each one of these on ibotta so we'll get four dollars back there it's gonna make the pair 58 cents i'm gonna throw in two febreze in this transaction there is no extra bucks back on these but um they're buy one get one 50 so 4.99 and 2.49 so i'm gonna give them this coupon so the second one's only 2.49 so they need to type in two dollars and 49 cents and it will glitch with the digital three dollars and 30 cents off of two so 2.49 will come off and three dollars and 30 cents will come off we're gonna pay a dollar 69 for two cans of febreze Basically doing a bunch of repeats in this last 10 off of 70, but I am going to grab the Gillette. It's the same thing as the Venus, $7.99. We have a $3 digital, and then we get $3 back in extra bucks. Makes it just $1.99. I also threw in the Aussie, and I'm going to throw in the Cover Girl. And last but not least, I am going to add in two of the 1029 Nivea lotions. I think I'm going to grab two of these aloe vera ones. I have a $2 digital for one and a $2 printable for the other from coupons.com. So two of them is $20.58. We're going to get $4 off. They'll bring us down to $16.58. And we're going to get a $10 extra buck back for spending $20. So it makes the cost $6.58 for both.
All right, friends, I know this is kind of a jumbled mess over here, but I was running out of room. This is my last transaction. It has the Lysol, the Febreze, Aussie CoverGirl, the Gillette Mach 3, the Colgate, and the Nivea. That all totals me up to $72.87. We'll have our 10 off 70 coming off, plus all of our other coupons that I've already showed you or told you about previously. It should bring us down to $30.08 pre-tax. And then we should get back $29 in extra bucks and $4 on Ibotta. So we should get back $33. That should make this like a $2.92 moneymaker if I did the math correctly. So I'm going to go up and cash out and call it a day here at CVS. So we'll go home and go over everything. All right, friends, we are back home with this weekly CVS haul. And I'm super excited about everything that I was able to grab today. Um, I did have a cost, like I told you guys in the video, but it was only a cost of $31.18 for everything on the table, which I'm super, super happy about. I saved $382.05 today, and I have 55 items. That works out to be $0.56 cents an item. Um, like I said earlier, I know CVS is kind of slow this week, but there are still a lot of really, really good deals. Um, you could definitely go in there with a budget of $20 and end up getting a ton of stuff. Um, and if you haven't started a new account yet, you really, really should. I mean, this week was the first week that my second new account finally had good CRTs, and it was a whole lot of fun couponing there today. Um, but yeah. I'm just going to go over my receipts and then we'll be able to call it a day. Here we go. All right, here's my first transaction. I had got my kids some glow sticks that were like 75% off. Um, it was a 40 pack for $1.75. So I just threw those in. Um, and this was on my account that one of my newer accounts that didn't have a 10 off of 70. Um, but then we have the Irish Spring, the Soft Soap. Two of the Optic Whites at $4.69, and then three CoverGirl, one at $5.49, two at $6.29, um, and then the Good Line Razor at $8.79, two Cetaphils at $10.49, and then that L'Oreal um, at $29.49. So I used two $3 paper coupons for the CoverGirl and two $4 paper coupon for the Cetaphils. I have the $5 digital for the Colgate, the $5 digital for the CoverGirl, $2 off the Soft Soap, $2 off the Irish Spring, and $2 off of the L'Oreal. Then the 8 off 30 L'Oreal CRT and the $4 off L'Oreal CRT. My 4 off 8 Goodline Razor and my $4 off Goodline. And then my 2 off 8 Colgate CRT. I used $46 in extra bucks and paid a subtotal of $1.20. So we spent out $47.20. I got back $4 for the soft soap, $4 for the Colgate, $10 for the L'Oreal, $5 for the Cetaphil, $6 for the CoverGirl, and then it did print me a 10 off of 70, which is awesome for next week. I did submit to Fetch. I got $1.20 back because I only need a little bit more for the Colgate. And then I also got $4 back on Ibotta for the Cetaphil. So we got a total of $34.20 back, making this receipt a cost of $13. Here's my next transaction I did on my other new account. We have the Chic um, Razor $15.79 original price, but those are on sale for $9.99. The two Aussies, buy one, get one, 40. The two Colgates at 469. And the telescopic mascara at 14.99. I didn't use any paper coupons. I had the $5 digital for the Colgate. I had two $4 off my purchase, a $3 CRT off the Chic, a $2 CRT off the hair, and a two off six hair. Then I used $20 in extra bucks, paid a subtotal of $2.34. I did end up using my extra bucks on my next transaction, but I got back three for the Chic, four for the Aussie. Aussie, four for Colgate, and five for the um, telescopic. So we spent out $22.34, got back $16. This was a cost of $6.34. Then on that same um, account, I did the Avino deal. So we have one at $11.99, and then two at $10.29, and then one at $9.29. I had two paper coupons for the Aveeno body washes for $2 off, one digital for $2 off, and then the $3 CRT. I used $21 in extra bucks to pay, paid a subtotal of $11.86, so we spent out $32.86. 
I got back my $6 extra buck and my $10 extra buck plus my $10 activate rewards card. So this was a cost of only $6.86. Then I did this transaction where I picked up two of the Dove. They're two for nine this week. The four Cottonelle, one at $5.79 and the other three at $4.99. The Gillette at $7.99. An Irish Spring, a soft soap. The two Colgates at $4.69 and I did the CoverGirl deal again, one at $5.49, two at $6.29. Um, I did use a lot of paper coupons in this transaction. So I had, what did I have? I had four $2 paper coupons. Oh, those were all for the Cottonelles because those all did work for the Cottonelles that I bought. Two $3 paper coupons for the CoverGirl and two $1.50 coupons for the Dove. Then you see my $5 CoverGirl Digital, $5 Colgate Digital, $3 Gillette, $2 Irish Spring, $2 Soft Soap, my 10 off of 70. I used my Care Pass, which only cost me $5, so that's why I crossed out and wrote $5. Then I used $25 in extra bucks and a $2 off my purchase, paid a subtotal of zero. Got back $5 for spending $20 on the Cottonelle. $4 for the Colgate, $4 for the Irish Spring and Soft Soap, $3 for the Gillette and Venus, $5 for the Dove, $6 for CoverGirl, and I got another 10 off 70 for next week. So we spent out 25, we got back 27. This receipt was a $2 moneymaker. Then I have the transaction with the Conair, which was on sale, I believe, for $10. And then a Maybelline at $7.79. Um, what is that? Not sure what that is right now. Um, oh, the Blade Razors and then the other Maybelline at $7.99. Um, so, right? I think so. Um, I used one $2 coupon for one of the Maybellines and then I had a $3 digital. Then I had a $3 instant CRT, a two off of 10 CRT. Then here are my 40% offs for the blade razors and then my 20% offs for the Maybelline. And then I had an extra 20% off one item that I threw on there. So I paid this with my debit card, $21.41, because I was using all of these percentage off CRTs. If you use extra bucks, it makes those amounts go down. Um, and then, so we spent out $21.41. We got back $10 for the Blade, $5 for the Conair, and $5 for the Maybelline. And then I did my last transaction where we have the Gillette at $7.99, the two Aussies, the two Febreze, the two Lysol, the two Colgate. They had no more $4.69 ones, so I did have to grab $5.29 ones there. I did the CoverGirl deal again, and then the two Nivea lotions at $10.29 each. I used two paper coupons for $3 for the CoverGirls, and then I had that buy one, get one coupon for the Febreze. And it's buy one, get one half, so they had to put in two forty nine. dollars There's my CoverGirl $5 digital, my Colgate $5, and then my Glitch with the Febreze for $3.30. My Gillette $3, my $2 Nivea coupon. My $2 printable Nivea coupon did not scan, so I just told her it was fine. There's my two $1 Lysol glitches, my 10 off of 70 I had a $2 off my the hair instant CRT that everybody got. Um, and then you see a six, a five, a four, and 49 cents in extra bucks, plus a $2 off my purchase. So we use 15.49 in extra bucks, paid a subtotal of 23.08. So we paid out 38.57. We got back $10 for the Nivea, $4 for Colgate, $3 for the Gillette, $4 for the Aussie, $6 for CoverGirl, and $2 for Lysol. Plus, I got back $4 on Ibotta for the Lysol wipes. So we paid out $38.57. We got back $29 and extra bucks for on Ibotta. So we got back $33. Made this last receipt a cost of $5.57. So like I said, you guys, today was a final cost of $31.18, which I am super, super happy with. Works out to be 56 cents an item. Um, that's all I have for you guys. So if you are not subscribed, please make sure you subscribe. It's totally free. Smash the like button for me. It really helps me out. Leave me a comment down below letting me know what your favorite deal is or if you have any deals you would like to share at CVS this week. 
make sure your notification bell is turned on and thank you so so much for coming back to watch and go on another cvs haul with me i'll see you all in the next one bye